Hello YouTube, this is The Bucket coming at you today with my Warrior Land Universal Light Laser compatible with Glock 17-19 Kydex kit. Warrior Land is a Chinese company that's been producing holsters and now is producing tactical lights. So that's why my light is a little bit different today. So let's talk about the gun. Let's, I'm sorry, let's talk about the holster. Let's talk about the light and let's talk about what you get. So when you get it in the box, you get a whole bunch of fun stuff. We'll talk about all those important things when we go through this review. So let's first of all, make show you that the gun is unloaded and we can talk about it. So this is a anodized aluminum housing, which holds a light and a green laser. There's three positions. There's the laser only position. There is the light laser combo. And then there is the light. One of the neat features that this gun has or that this light has is it has a LCD screen here, which will let you know the power level and the lumen level that your lights at. And then it'll tell you who made it. I is ambidextrous, so you can operate it with your trigger finger or your support hand, one click on, one click off. You can adjust down here to the three features. Again, all the way to the right is going to be light, then middle is gonna be light laser, and then all the way to the light is going to be the um, laser only. One of the really neat features that this has is if you push in both of the paddles at the same time, you have their moonlight feature, which is a five lumen light, which is really amazing if you don't wanna blind yourself or the people in your family with 800 lumens of light. This will last for 60 minutes. It'll go down to 500 lumens towards the end as the battery life goes down, but that's a lot of light and it'll go for like, quadruple that length if you're on the moonlight feature. One of the nice things is that with this, since it's a holster company, they designed this holster to fit a Glock 17 or 19. Now this is a Glock 23, but as you know, a Glock 23 is the same as a Glock 19 dimensionally. So it works just fine. Mine was a little loose when I got it, so I did have to tighten it up. And one of the things that I didn't like about this particular setup is it doesn't give you an auditory click. So I put a, I went ahead and I put it on and I practiced with it. And it's on there. It's good and tight. It's not going anywhere. But if you like that comfort of a real good auditory click, this holster isn't going to provide it for you. But it is ha, does have a cut for an MOS. So if you have an MOS Glock 17, 19, 22, or 23, and you run a red dot, this holster will work with it. So that's a real big plus. And since they're the manufacturer of the light and the laser, the fit is really good and tight. So for $130, a high quality light and holster that's designed for your gun and your light, that's a really, really good deal. So what you come with, what it comes with in the package is you do get the cord because this is magnetically charged. You don't have to take off your light to charge back up your um, your light, which is really great. And the fact that it gives you that is awesome. It will give you the screwdriver because if you happen to not have a Glock 17, 19, 22, or 23, it gives you five other plates so you can, adjust, you can attach that to your light and it'll fit your gun. And it fits so many different gun manufacturers and they will all then place the controls right there at the trigger guard. Because with some of the stream lights that you get, it'll hook up to the Picatinny, but then the light is so far, the controls are so far away that if you don't have big hands, it's not as good of a fit for your gun. So I love the fact that they made the interchangeability and set it up specifically for so many different guns. And it gives you a, in the manual, it talks to you about which plate you'll need for which manufacturers. And it gives you a ton of different options and shows you what they are. Now, one of the things that also, when I'm looking at this manual, is when you get it out of the package, your laser is probably not going to be at point of aim and point of impact, so you are going to have to adjust it. Now, you can use a Fiocchi uh, bore laser light, and I'll uh, put a link to the video there, but it gives the tools that you need. You've got your elevation, and you've got your windage right here, and one of the things that I really like is on like the third page here, it really gives you a great explanation of how to adjust it. 
So for instance, if I'm working with my windage, if I want to go to the left, it tells you that you rotate it clockwise. And if you want to go to the right, you go counterclockwise. I love the fact that the manual is very easy to read and it shows you exactly how to do it because it can be kind of frustrating if you haven't done it before. So that's really awesome that they give you a lot of good information in kind of a small manual. So that's really good. And I love the fact that it gives you the tool. One of the downsides is it doesn't have clicks on the tool. It seems really, really tight. And I have shot the gun with this light on it and it did hold zero really pretty well. But if you're one of those people that you do like the feel of that um, click, if you do like the sound of the auditory click and you know that it's gonna hold, um, that's one of the things that this particular light laser combo doesn't have. That being said, $130 for a, a holster that's gonna fit just right. You're gonna get 800 lumens. It's even gonna drop down to 500 lumens as the battery life goes down to get you that full 60 minutes. It really does fit really, really good in the hand. It's very well thought out in its design. I think it's an absolutely great deal. I don't. I like the fact that the light's not so flipping huge that it looks really goofy or makes the holster very uncomfortable to carry. I think that this is a, a great setup. It's really well thought out, really well designed. It's real tight on there. It's very easy to install or to take off or to move from one to the other. I think that um, Warrior Land really knocked it out of the park. Anybody thinking about getting this, I think would be uh, doing themselves a lot of favors. Really good job by Warrior Land. Go to Amazon, check out uh, their their uh, store on Amazon, and uh, think about picking one of these up. So I want to thank you guys so much for supporting the channel, all the likes, the comments, the shares. They're really appreciated. And as always, you stay classy, YouTube. Little middle baby bucket. Do you want to live in California? No. Why? Because I'm not a communist.